emotions are scattered all over the place. One minute, I'm sobbing all my insides out, and then the next minute, I forget everything because I still feel like spirit is still here by my side. Your face, so innocent, like ones of a child. Your cheeks, so innocent and happiness. And your laugh had no sense of any harm or guilt. I can feel your presence here right now, just laughing and smiling at everything like you once did when you were with us. This whole incident is probably the biggest smack in the face that I could ever get. Losing you was the first time I've ever cried as hard as I did, and I mean ever. Every single time I close my eyes, all I can picture is you doing the exercise activities shown at Tifa. You were just smiling and happy and like you did, like you did the craziest moves that they showed. I remember whenever you came over, whenever we came over at your home, you would always tell us to get go get food, not just any food, but your homemade rice and your signature curry that you put time, effort, and every single strength doing. Oh, and also those delicious sausages, like um, Christmas or any other occasion. At this point, it would just be the same without you. After losing you, did I only realize how precious life really is? For your entire life, you spent time getting to know someone day by day, building a bond that you think no one is capable of breaking. And then in the split of a second, just one blink of an eye, it's all finished. And you are left there, hopeless and filled with agony and pain that is inexpressible, leaving you just laying there tweaked in sorrow and grief. My dear Saskapa, without you here by my side, I can surely tell you that there is a part of me that is empty and that can only be fixed by you here. You are the most precious gift given to us from God and can never be replaced. One thing is for sure is that I know you're in a better place where there is no tiredness, sorrow, and misery. Surely you're going to miss all the car rides filled with tons of advice and stories of your past and your lack, and most of all, you as a whole. Love you so much, my dear Sambo. Rest in peace. <coughs> Right now, 
some cuts and stop fighting and to remember him for all the good times. He will tell us you are God and that the greatest place you can be and that one day we will all be together and we'll go back and live your life like he did with unconditional love, compassion, and forgiveness just as our Lord Jesus Christ did when he brought the earth. Oh, 